Crypto regulation's coming. We all know it is. It's something that is basically as inevitable as death and taxes, if you will. And uh, this is definitely a situation where, you know, hey, don't shoot the messenger. It is coming. I will tell you up front that crypto regulation, however you feel about it, love it, hate it, don't like it, whatever. Um, it is the path to the crypto market growing exponentially. And I'm going to tell you real simply why. You have billions with a B, you have billions of people sitting on the sideline waiting until there is some semblance of regulation around the entire crypto space in one way or the other, regulating various components of it to, air quotes coming, legitimize crypto. Now, I already feel crypto is legitimate. I'm talking about billions of people out there that are much more conservative and they don't really get it and all this kind of stuff. My point to you, okay? But th these billions of people represent trillions with a T, represent trillions of dollars and global money globally, okay? And for us to grow the entire crypto market to three, four, five, six plus trillion dollar market, regulation has to happen. There you go. Okay, so there's a couple of key things that I want to show to you and outline. Okay, I've got another, I'll do another video today as well talking about regulation, but there's a lot going on here. So we are starting to get glimpses into and starting to see the first peaks, if you will, at what the U.S., crypto regulation bill is going to look like, okay? And there's a lot of information out there, okay? So number one, where this red is, it would liberate small-scale purchases of goods and services uh, from taxes, um, basically if it's less than 200 bucks, basically clearing the path for crypto to be used as a currency. Pretty cool, that's number one. Number two, um, it looks like there's going to be here in the United States, most likely a new government, a new governing body that will oversee crypto and it will be known as the Commodity Futures Trading Commission, CFTC. Okay. Um, it will, and, and the big bill would seem to be going after, uh, stable coins, tax on small scale payments and the jurisdiction of regulators. It's also going to really be going hard after, uh, like I said, stable coins, potentially DeFi, um, you know, DAOs, exchanges. These are going to be the biggies. So compliance, DAOs, exchanges, stable coins would have to become registered ent ent entities. Uh, they allegedly, if if not registered, they'd be allegedly subjected to taxes. So DAOs are going to have to most likely be be registered. Um, exchanges, stable coin providers, things of that nature. Again, all under this new kind of governing body with it is the. Uh, the CFT. Okay. All right. So there's also this discussion of whether crypto is going to be classified as a commodity or as a security. It would seem that it's leaning towards being classified as a commodity. There's a, now there's a debate of whether Bitcoin and Ethereum are different than say on altcoins like say Cardano or Solana or you know Avalanche, Shiba Inu, whatever it may be. That's still up for debate. Okay. So the these are some of the big things that we are seeing coming into the fold. Okay. Um, this is basically a starting point and this is a biggie. Uh, there's really not going to be any major advancements until or kind of movement on this until 2023. So you're going to see a lot more information coming out around regulation, but really at the end of the day, you know, this thing's not going to be here tomorrow, right? It's going to take time. It's going to take time for all these different pieces because this is a far reaching, very complex scenario, i.e. how we regulate crypto. If you think about all the different sectors of crypto, right? You've got blockchain, you've got uh, commodities versus securities, you've got DeFi, stable coins, uh, community coins, uh, you know, exchanges, centralized, decentralized exchanges. You've got, and how do you regulate in one way or the other all of these different various components of it, okay? So that's really where we're at, okay? And uh, I'll have another video coming out later today, a little bit more diving into deep into, into crypto regulation. Just know that it's coming. Um, and it's not necessarily a bad thing at the end of the day. Yes, it's not fun, but hey, this it is what it is and this is going to happen, okay? So that's what I've got for you on crypto regulation right this second. Again, more video, more content on the way as well. I'll see you.